Hi, Warren Carr here from Blind Android Users Podcast, and I'm sitting here unboxing Nothing. And by the way, this is the Nothing 2. The first Nothing phone did not come to the United States. And if you're not familiar with the Nothing, something that we refer to on the Blind Android Users Podcast, when we talked about it last year, we made reference to it as the Christmas tree phone. So this is nothing too. Of course, the founder is Carl Pei, who used to be part of the founders of OnePlus and defected and started his own. Yes, today I'm unboxing nothing. Unlike many people who like to describe what the box looks like, the color box and all of that, I simply want to get to business. So I just picked this up from the mail and I'm going to try to unbox it. It's a nothing. And it comes in a square box, if you want to know what the box looks like. And looks like, from the looks of it, after I tear it open, I'll just see the device. See what we got. Okay. Trying to tear off the tip so much. Tip around the ends and all of that, corners. Exit a little bit difficult. Here we go. I think I got it. Ah, not quite. There we go. A little something left here. There we go. There we go. I just unboxed it. Inside is another square box. It reminds me so much of the Pixel Fold box. And of course you want to hear what's in the box. So it has, wow. Let's see what it, what it has. Looks like they gave me a shirt or pair of shorts or something, but some kind of clothing. I think it's most like a pair of shorts. Definitely, that's what it feels like, a pair of shorts. And that's it, nothing in, in that box. Um, I don't think it even has a charging cord. Nope, not feeling one. Um, all I'm seeing a pair of shorts. I bet that probably says nothing on it. So I'm wearing this shirt. I'll be wearing nothing. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, very minimalistic. Well, I think I'm wrong. I need to open the other box, the other square box. Maybe the, uh, the cord will be in that. But, so... Let's put this aside and look at this other box here and see what we got in there. So again, like I said, this looks like the Pixel Fold box. It's also square. And let's see. So I must say that the box is very difficult to pry open and I don't think I'm even doing it right. I'm probably destroying it as it is. I think I am. Aye, aye, aye. Yeah, definitely very difficult to get this thing open. There we go. Uh, 
I've practically destroyed the box. <laughs> feel sorry for the box and then I pull it out of that other box and another box oh my goodness I hope this one is not as difficult all right the inner one is not difficult oh, something comes tumbling off see. All right, I found what tumbled off. That was the USB-C cord. Now the box itself just opens up, just a flap. Has some kind of embroidery work on the cover. All right, in there we got the USB-C cord, like I said. There's another little box in here. I believe contains a little bit of paperwork and probably the uh, SIM tool removal tool in there. And the phone is sitting on the other side. There's the phone. Let's take a look. We got wrapped in a little paper there again. And I'm going to try to open this up. Very strong adhesive here. There we go. And out comes the device. So I'm holding the device in my hand and frankly feels to me like a Fruitvale phone if you've been following Fruitvale. Um, the back is glass. And the sides, of course, are metallic. And like Fruitvale, you know, I believe this is a power on the right-hand side and then the volume keys or volume buttons on the left side. Filling the top, I feel a little depression on the top right, maybe the antenna. And let's see if there's any SIM port on the side or if it's at the bottom. Let's see, feeling the left side where the volume keys are. I don't believe I feel any holes. Let's feel the right side. I don't feel any either. So let's look at the bottom. Bottom feels like I have the SIM card tray to the left of the USB-C port. The USB-C port is in the middle and then to the right of it, I believe, is a speaker grill. And to the left of it is the SIM card. I'm going to get my SIM ejection tool and try to see if I'm correct. Yep, I'm correct. There is the SIM tray. So again, there it is. Push it back in. So again, at the bottom, you got the SIM tray to the left of the USB-C port and to the right of it will be the speaker grill. On the back of the phone, we have the cameras and they're on the right side, on the back toward the top, they are round. So two round cameras there at the top right on the back side of the device. All right, so that will be the unboxing of it. I'll be doing a review of it. But though, let's go ahead and turn it on and see if we could start TalkBack with holding down the two volume keys or holding two fingers on the phone. I'll now turn that thing on, see if I feel any vibration. I hope it's not dead. Oh, there we go, I heard boom. And I'm gonna wait. And I'm still waiting. I'm still waiting. Okay, the 
case I can see a little bit, I can see a very red bright spot in the middle. And of course some writing at the bottom and some at the top. Unlike the Pixel device, of course, you don't feel the thing that I refer to as the heartbeat, which is the pulsating feel that you feel when it's there on the setup screen. So I'm assuming that this has reached where I could set it up. So I'm going to put my two fingers down and see if I hear it instructing me to keep holding those fingers down to enable accessibility. And if it does, then I'll switch to the volume keys and see what happens. I don't believe it's there, but nothing. Of course, it's a nothing. Uh, <laughs> now, I'm going to hold down the two volumes. Oh, I heard some vibration. Talk back on. Held volume keys. Talk back turned on. Welcome to talk back. Welcome to talk back. Page 1 of 5, TalkBack is a screen reader intended for situations or people who have difficulty seeing the screen. It gives you spoken feedback so that you can use your device without looking at the screen. You can turn TalkBack on or off by holding both volume keys for several seconds. When TalkBack is on, the... Okay, so I just turn up the volume. And you heard how it sounds like... So the sound is a little bit... It's not as boomy as the sound that you will hear on a Pixel device. Look forward to seeing my review, and this has been unboxing of the Nothing Too Phone.